Want to learn Filipino anywhere, anytime? Get the Innovative Language 101 app for free. Hi guys. Hi guys. Hi guys. Welcome to Filipino Toppers with me, Ice. And today's topic is... 10 hardest words to pronounce. Okay, so just try and say these words. And I'm sure like your Filipino friends will be very impressed. Try practicing these words so we can pronounce it properly. Baba Baba, going down. This first one is actually a sentence and it's just made of one syllable which is ba. So it goes Baba Baba, it means going down. Baba means down. And Baba Ba means going down. And the ba at the end is like our question marking particle. So ba 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 ba. If you are going down and someone asks this to you, then you just reply with o oh, o oh, meaning yes or or ba ba ba. So ba 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 ba. It's like the longest conversation in Filipino using one syllable. Bulaklak, flower. Okay, next is bulaklak, meaning flower. For example, mabango ang bulaklak. The flower smells good. Dumadagundong, rumbling. Dumadagundong, meaning rumbling. Doesn't it sound like it's a rumbling noise? Like, dumadagundong. It's like all the bass in that word. For example, dumadagundong na ang bagyo sa labas. The storm is already rumbling outside. Dumadagundong. 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 Di ka panipaniwala. Unbelievable. Next is, di ka panipaniwala, meaning unbelievable. For example, di ka panipaniwala ang sinapit ng pamilya niya. The plight of his family is unbelievable. Kagilagilalas. Astounding. Next is, kagilagilalas, which means astounding. Hindi na ako nakakakita ng kagilagilalas na pangyayari. I no longer see any astounding events. Kinakailangan. Important. Next one is kinakailangan, meaning important. Kinakailangan laging maging tapat sa trabaho. We must always be honest at work. Kumukuti-kutitap, twinkling. Next one is kumukuti-kutitap, meaning twinkling. So I guess the hard part of this is like the vowels because like it's mostly u, but there's like i and a uh, somewhere. Kumukuti kutitap. I guess the only way to pronounce this is to remember all the syllables. Kumukuti kutitap. Twinkling. Ang between ay kumukuti kutitap. The star is twinkling. How would you even sing like twinkle twinkle little star? Kumukuti kutitap. Kumukuti kutitap. <laughs> try to try to say it very fast. Like kumukuti kutitap. Kumukuti kutitap. Kumukuti kutitap. <laughs> Mamasa masa, moist. The next is mamasa masa, meaning moist. You have to be careful of the accents here because masa means moist, but there's another word spelled the same called masa, which means the masses. So masa and masa. So just be careful to say it as masa. Mamasa masa. For example, mamasa masa pa ang damo. The grass is still moist. Misterioso. Mysterious. Next one is misterioso, meaning mysterious. I don't know, it sounds like it's easy enough to pronounce. Like, just mis- mysterious becomes misterios with an O at the end. Like, Spanish people could do it. Misterioso. For example, siya ay isang misteryosong babae, meaning she is a mysterious woman. Patalastas, commercial. Next one is patalastas, meaning commercial. This one, I actually had a problem saying this when I was a kid. And I just, yeah, I just remember it being very hard for me, but yeah, now it's fine. For example, laging maraming patalastas ang laban ni Manny Pacquiao. Manny Pacquiao's fights always have a lot of commercials. Cause yeah, those things like involve a lot of money. So they need a lot of commercials. 
Okay, and that's it for today. That was 10 hardest words to pronounce. Which do you think is the hardest one to pronounce for you? Like, just comment down below. Do you have any word that you think is hard for me to pronounce? And I will accept your challenge. <laughs> or like, if you could think of any word that is hard to pronounce in Filipino, put it in the comment below. Maybe I'll try to say it for you in the next lessons. <laughs> Anyway, that's it for today. Thank you for watching and if you like this video, press the thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. And if you want to learn more Filipino, check out our site, filipinopod101.com. See you again next time. Thank you, salamat, and paalam.